Hi, so just thought I'd film a video on a few products that I've accumulated over the past week. I bought just a few items, so I thought I'd share them with you and just um, give you my opinions on them. So my first order was um, to Debenhams, so it just has all different types of makeup in there. And the first item that I bought was the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. Um, this is my favourite foundation. It's the best one that does cover up all of my acne scars. Um, I do recommend it if you are looking for a more full coverage foundation. It just gives you, like... It's quite matte, but it's not too matte. It doesn't like dry your skin out. It's my favorite foundation for a while now, um, since I found it. But I am wearing it today, and if you've seen my other videos, you will see that I do have a lot of acne scarring um, in the start of my videos. But I do wear this foundation, and to be honest, I do think it covers it quite well. I just got another one of them. Um, my shade is Desert Beige. So I also got an Estee Lauder double wear stay in place eye pencil and this is in burgundy suede this is just a really nice eye pencil so i normally get like a black one or something like that but for the days where you just kind of want it a bit more softer and um, not jet black um, i thought i'd get this it is a really nice shade it is still quite dark but um like i said it's not as dark as like a jet black it's like a nice brown shade so I got those two items and then there was actually an offer on and it was like if you buy a third item you get two free items with it. So I got the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Lip Pencil and this is in rose. So it's just a really nice like pinky mauve type of colour. So that's what I bought same out of the Estee Lauder. Um, so like I said there was an offer on so when I bought those three items I did get two free items. So the first free item was an Estee Lauder Illuminating Perfect Primer. So it is actually a 30ml as well, so I think that's quite good. Um I see I haven't actually looked at this yet, so it's really nice, it's really nice and creamy. Um I'm not sure if you'll be able to see but it's that like glowy bit there um, I feel like that would be nice under your foundation especially under like a matte foundation so I think I'll try that next time I'm doing my makeup just see what that goes on like um, so again I think that's really good like you've got that whole primer free and it's a 30ml and then the next thing that you get free they always do this little like offer I got it last time and it was like like a navy bag but this time this bag is so cute she's got like a woman arm with me for um so you got this bag free and you got quite a few products inside so you got the day wear moisturizer and um, it's really nice it smells so fresh and um, you also got a little sample size of the advanced night repair um it's a serum it's only seven mils but I do have the big version of this and it's just so good like it just it does repair your skin so I use it every single night and I just feel like my skin's like softer in the morning it's really nice and um, but it, although that's only little um it does actually last quite a while you also got the the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Cream it's the same as that serum that I've just got but um it is for your eyes so I haven't actually used this one yet, but I will use it to see what it's like. I've also got a nail varnish. It's a really lovely colour. This is in Beautiful Liar, the shade it's called, and it's just a really nice colour. also got, which I thought was quite good, it's a little tiny, like, clear bottle for foundation. So if you go into Debenhams and show them this, um, they will put your shades in the bottle. And like that is quite a good size bottle. I think you'd get like quite a few days wear of that. So that was a good little idea. I actually thought that they might have sent out just any random shades when I did see the bag. And I was hoping that they sent out a nice shade. You also got the Estee Lauder Take It Away. Um, so this is just like a makeup remover. It's like a cream. I've used it before and it is really good. It just breaks down everything on your face. And especially the double wear foundation that I do use. It's really like... If I'm just using normal makeup remover, I have to use so many cotton pads to get it off. But with this, I feel like it just breaks it down so quickly and it just wipes it away so easy. 
and then the last things you got in the bag which again this was all free which is just amazing um it's the fa lauder pure color um lipstick and it's in the shade wildly pink i don't tend to go for pink but i do think this is a really nice shade like it's not like barbie pink or like a baby pink um, so I'll just swatch this and it is um, like a nice glossy shimmery one so you can see that there like it is quite a hot pink but I think it would look really nice like I think I'll get used to that out of that in the summer which is a really nice shade and like I said it's a really like glossy and like shimmery like you can see in the light there so it's really moisturising on your lips that was all free in that bag which I just think is amazing it's such a good offer and like I just love their products obviously with the foundation I'm always buying from there and they do have offers on like that all the time which is great so the next thing I did buy from Debenhams is the Makeup Forever Step 1 Skinny Equalizer Smoothing Primer I always use this one I think it's the best one that I've found for me pores really but um, it just looks like this it's a 30ml and I just think it's the best one that I've used um, I haven't actually run out from the other one yet so I don't need to use it yet but um just there for what I do. So that was everything that I got from Debenhams. Um, then I did make an order on cultbeauty.com. So what I ordered, I got two Morphe brushes, which I'm obsessed with. So I got the from the I think it's from the Elite range. Um, it's the E31. It's just like a big buffing brush. You can see that there. It's just a really like rounded flat top brush and it is so soft and I mean so soft like it is lovely I can't wait to try this out, out with foundation just to see um, how well it blends but it's just a really really nice brush I do like this I love it I also got another brush from Cult Beauty so this is a Morphe M310 so this is like a fan brush and um, you can just see that there so this is just obviously for your highlighter, can't wait to try this out, I want to know how it applies the highlighter. I did see Jacqueline Hill had this one though and she said it's amazing. Also from Cult Beauty, um, I got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer. I got this in dark brown, so it just looks like that. It's got a spoolie on one end and obviously your product on the other end it's just in a triangle shape and you've got like you can use it like quite thickly or it's got like the tip where you can obviously just use the point and you'll get like a really sharp line i did use it today for the first time this is what i've got on my brows now and i do think it is really nice and um, what i would say is just get rid of a light hand at first you don't want to go in too hard because I did do it lightly at first and the colour payoff is so good, like it's so pigmented and so much does come off so I would just go with a light hand and it'll work out fine and just also keep using the spoolie so it'll blend it out nicely. So that was all from Cult Beauty. I didn't actually purchase this myself but I've been wanting it for so so long and my sister actually bought me it so this is the Kylie Lip Kit in Dolce K. I have been wanting this colour since the pictures were out and the first time she launched it they just were sold out in like 10 seconds or something which was ridiculous the second time again it happened again and then the third time I had them in my basket and my bank decided to decline the card because they thought it was fraud safe to say I was not happy that day <laughs> um, I don't know why they've done it I always order from America so I wasn't happy but they launched again and I kind of had given up and then my sister sent me a screenshot of an old confirmation saying that she's got it for me and I was so happy so in this you obviously get you get a lip liner and you also get the liquid lipstick and um, so I'll just swatch these now but they are just I wore it for the first time the other day to a party that I went to and the lip liner is just so creamy like it goes on so well and the little lipstick it's not it's not uncomfortable at all it's just like really nice on your lips it doesn't crumble nothing like that and i did not have to touch it up once the whole night i'm just going to swatch the lip liner and then i will do the li liquid lipstick next to it and these 
they smell like um they kind of smell like the NYX soft matte lip cream like frost them it's so nice this is the lip liner and this is the lip and lipstick so it's just such a nice colour like I'm into all the like nudes and browns and they are just my favourite colours so when I did see that Dolce K I needed it straight away so I'm really really grateful that my sister did end up getting me that so that is all that I've actually got for this week I thought I'd just um, show you what I did buy this week so I hope you enjoyed the video um, if you did just give it a thumbs up comment down below what you've recently bought and also subscribe so um, I'll see you in my next video bye